Hey guys, RC here. Welcome back. Well, Club Six, Season One, Episode One. Where are we going? Let me move my microphone there just a tad. There we are. Uh, so yes, where are we going? Well, I can tell you it's not in jolly old England because those people have no sense of humor. No. Um, we applied for several jobs in League Two, uh, League One. I even applied. The Leeds job came open. Uh, I even applied for that. Uh, never even got an interview. So I applied for about a dozen jobs, and a lot of them were lower end. Uh, a couple of jobs in Italy with uh, one and a half to two star reputation clubs. Never got an interview because I haven't, you know. And I guess because I haven't coached there and I had, you know, but thinking that I've been in three nations, just really discouraging. So where are we going? Well, let's take a look. Well, we're up in the UK, but we're not in England. So that's probably a giveaway. So where are we going? Well, we're going to Bala Town Football Club in Bala, UK. So let's zoom in here a little bit. And I suppose... Now, okay, so Wales is this province, right? Am I using the right term there? Is it a province out there? Not sure. But uh, so, but it's located in Wales, so I guess it is in England. My bad. <laughs> I'm confused. So let's see. Let me get a kind of, all right, there's Leeds up in Yorkshire. There's Scum. Bristol. All right, there's London down here. All right, so it's South Chester. Okay, I've heard of Chester, Blackpool. I applied for the Blackpool job. No interest. So let's zoom in here to Bala Town. All right, there's a national park here. Cool. Right on the edge of this national park. I bet that's a pretty area. It's got some water. Now, we're moving from... We're going to have to move here. So... A little too far to commute. Ackroyd and Sons Business Center, the Bala Golf Club. All right, so it's a really small town coming in on A494. Got a little farm out here, the River D. All right, a sailing club, nice. Very country club looking area. Uh, let's see, co op foods, car parks. There is where we're at off the a4212 and station road a494 pretty easy access we're a bowling club too all right so this is not google Ma oh you know what let's change it over there there we are all right so not the greatest looking pitch it's definitely a step down from where we've been looks like they have an old uh, old track out here that looks like maybe I see some boxes here. That may be a practice, like a half half size practice field. But that looks like our pitch. That's really scary. The grass is green, except uh, the little triangle in front of the uh, goal there. Okay, kind of buried in this little subdivision here, so. You know, we have these here in the States. Unfortunately, they're youth soccer fields. Soccer fields, because they're in the States. Over there, they're the football fields. But uh, they're, they're youth facilities for 8, eight 10, 12-year-olds uh, in the middle of the community like that. Oh, well. this You know, we knew this was a step back. I am going to miss that, that $2 million, and I'm going to miss Europe next year. But, hey, we soldier on soldier on we had to do this guys i think we had to do this just to see if we if we can build the reputation because if we can't then i think it's just time to to put the kibosh on this and move on to the next save all right we've got a country house car parks all right so that's what we've got the name of the field is Mez tegrid Mez tejid it's tejid field it's in Bella, Wales, mostly for football matches. 
holds 3,000 people, so it's the same size stadium that we had uh, at Carl Scrona. 504 seats been used since the 50s. Uh, the seats, oh my God, they're secondhand seats from Chesterfield and Coventry. And they were installed when Bala won promotion to the Welsh Premier League. Uh, they use Rills Bella View Stadium due to UEFA stadium regulations. They installed a synthetic pitch in 2016. The record attendance in real life is 938. That's awesome. Taking a quick look, uh, they've got this is the real club right now. Uh, they've got 23 people, average age 28 years, six months, 16 foreigners. Current record plus or, or transfer record plus or minus zero. Uh, Josh Tibbetts. I am probably not going to recognize any of these names, but you never know. Maybe we'll come across the odd one. I'm going to say no. All right. Well, there's our club. Uh, let's see. Taking a look at the history. Uh, they were founded in 1880, so it's 140 years old today. Keeping in mind, it makes it almost 200 years in the game now. We'll have to check the stadium because I don't know if that's uh, in the game, you know, moving ahead that long. We've been in the uh, UEFA Europa League five times in real life. That's never advanced, but hey, that's that's pretty solid. I have not looked at anything yet. I have, uh, you know, you'll see when we get into the game. Uh, yeah, so anyway, let's uh, close all that out. So Balatown has hired RC. 12 years of uh, club soccer experience. Now, see here, you guys were getting mad at me. Football manager calls it soccer in the game. I had nothing to do with that. So I've been away from club football recently. 12 years of experience with FC Mets and Halson. Uh, I was subject of considerable criticisms following a Spenska Kupen exit at the hands of Eskelmeen, but picked his team up from defeat and moves into his new job with positive momentum behind him. Ballatown are currently 10th place in the Corbett Sports Welsh Premier Football League. They have lost four of their last five games. So they have a one-star reputation, and that's all I could get, guys. All I could get. Uh, we have no coaches. Again, I have not looked at anything. They're still playing at Tejid Field, uh, 3,000 capacity. Club history, they've won the Welsh Cup twice, most recently in 2035. Uh, the J.D. Simru North in 2058. The Caradigion lead in 2009. Those are those are real fixtures here, it looks like. Like real, like current history. All right. We're playing a 4-4-2. Have not looked at the roster yet. No transfer obligations. Uh, we've got three players, two players on loan in, one player on loan out. Are they any good? actually not bad four star for the current squad okay uh, they expect it they demand that we work within the payroll budget avoid relegation reach the quarterfinals of the Welsh Cup remember when we took the last job we were already out of the cup and they held it against us I found that odd and reached the third round minimum of the Welsh League Cup which I guess is different from the Welsh Cup, and work towards repairing the club's financial damage. They did sign me to a two-year contract. Uh, it's not a lot. Uh, no press conference, please. All right. I am going to take care of all this business off camera, start hiring some people. Uh, in fact, let's take a look at our staff. It's just me. So I need... I have a scout. 
All right, so I want an advertisement for an assistant coach and a coach. We're not going to go overboard. I like general managers. They don't bother me. And I would like one more scout. And I have nothing over here. So let's look for a head physio. We'll do that. Looks like we have a transfer put in. All right, well, let me get everything. Ooh, preview. Healthy number of new fullbacks. A top prospect in central mid. All right, well, I'm going to go through this, and we will be back with uh, whatever news I have coming up. See you guys in a second. All right, well, we're back. We haven't really accomplished anything. I was try I put ahead... Uh, Went ahead and put the job advertisements out. Uh, I went after, uh, you remember Stian Neslund, the coach we just hired at Karls Karlskrona that had played with us before? Offered him a contract. He didn't even want to talk to us. He said, I view that as a major demotion, which it is. Uh, and he would not even talk to us. So taking a look at the competition, uh, we were knocked out in the third round. Uh, how they can hold those against you when it's already happened. Uh, reached the quarterfinals. We are in the fourth round against Afan Lido. Uh, that'll be on January 21st. So we're December 17th, 2061. So we're on track for that. Looks like they were as high as third early in the season. Dropped to fifth and then uh, have tailed off into 10th position uh, they are in the drop zone, uh, just edging out Airbus Broughton uh, by three goals on the goal differential, three wins, seven draws, and eight losses in 18 matches. Let's take a look because I haven't looked at the rules yet. Uh, so they play 32 games. So we have 14 left. We're just over the halfway mark. Had to think about it and do math. Now, UEFA Champions League qualifying round. Boy, the prize money sucks. Ugh. Euro 2, Euro 2, and European Places playoffs. All right, well, there's prize money. That's better than nothing. And we get European playoffs if we finish seventh or better. Nothing wrong with that, I suppose. Now, the Premier League is the 52nd, number 52 overall league in Europe. And then we go into the Youth Cup. So they're actually the top league in, in Wales. So there's nowhere to go from here. There is no promotion. There's just European. So we really need to win this uh, to get our reputation up. Oh, look, Cardiff Met Uni. Okay, I've heard of them. I actually applied for these guys, Sep and Druids. I applied for that job. Uh, they gave me an interview and then turned me down, and they went with uh, this guy instead. Probably can't blame them. Probably can't blame them, but, you know, it hurt. It hurt. He's got a full two-star reputation, not just one and a quarter. So, uh, yeah, you know, so good on him. All right. So we're only going to do one match today because this is going to take a little while because I have not picked a team yet. I don't have um, any coaches to help me out with the auto select like I do. And, uh, wow, we have lost to these guys 75 times. We've beaten them nine and drawn 16. That's insane. So I guess what we're going to have to do here, I want to pull my central defenders first. He's horrible. And he has no pace. Uh, so Courtney, I am going to move him to move to U19 just to get him out of here for right now. All right, I'm going to move him to U19. 7, 12, 12. Could be worse, I suppose. He's crap. 
Buff tackling, seven marking. Ollie Woods. So looks like he is, he's 5'10", 6'12", 11". Let's go ahead and put him in. And then we're going to change over to the left side. Man, these guys certainly aren't as good as the ones I just left. All right, I think we're going to move. Yeah, Lewis Wilson, we'll put him on the left. Owen Bamford. We're going to hold off there. And we will put, well, he may be a mid, so we'll, we'll hold off. I'm not going to worry about subs so much right now. 12-12. Now, he can play all three, so I do like him there. All right, I'm going to put Kai Wood over here, and then we're going to put, uh, I think we're going to put them on the bench. All right, let's look at our midfielders, central midfielders. Passing is a seven, first touch, free kick. I like him. Let's put him in the box-to-box -box role. Oh, he's got awesome passing. There is my playmaker. Daniel Pernice. Mm, actually, you know what? We'll move you to the bench here, and Pernice will be our box-to-box. -box. What's greening look like? Pace is a little off. All right. All right. Massa on the left. Pacey, first touch, free kick taking. He's not bad. He's got dribbling, passing. I'm thinking, I'm thinking. Free kick. The fact that I can see their stars here and it won't, but it won't show it in the game is troubling. All right, Moss is on the bench. We're going to put Wilkes out wide. And then, I'm liking him. Yeah, look, we're going to go with Ken Tipton here. Then I need to look at attackers all sides very very short oh my god a one finishing are you shitting me all right well you can go on the bench you'll be a winger i guess 10 finishing okay there's our well, no pace though Ugh. he's left footed we're gonna put him over here Roberts, oh, Roberts is on the bench, Newberry there. All right, let's see what else we got now. So all positions, we've already got our keeper. Jamoa. Oh, I already had him. Never mind. Okay, here we go. That's where we want to go. Declan Owen Bamford. He can play two positions, so let's stick him in there. And Greening. All right, we're going to put Cameron Locke on the bench. May not be the best group, but you know, at least they're accomplished. Tempo's going to be a little off. I am going to change these guys to central defenders just because I don't think they're going to be quality enough. Uh, I'm going to leave them at wing back for right now. I'm not expecting to win this game at all. So, yeah, just a real quick look. So, it's me. I've got a scout. I'm not even sure how good he is. He's not very good. David, is that David or Daffod? I'm thinking it's Daffod, but it may be pronounced David. David Greenhoff. Okay. Uh, seven and seven. Fair enough. Can you know what? Can I? 
I don't think it'll let me do that. No, it won't. It has to be a coaching member. All right, well, let's submit the team. Let's get this first match out of the way. Talk about needing to hit the ground running. We're playing the top team in the table. We're tied for relegation. We owe them some revenge. So, yeah, first day in the office, I had a player come in and tell me he was concerned about the club's finances. Well, we knew they were in dire straits. Oh, we oh, we had a shot there early on. Um, and I said, look, you know, I'm just getting here. I'm just getting started. Give me a couple of weeks, and if you're still concerned then we can talk some more. Nope, that was not good enough for him. And he uh, let me know in no uncertain terms and that he was going to do his best to get the entire squad and the entire locker room uh, upset with me. So that was nice. Oh, McKenzie. Oh, that's not good. Vincent Osumba. His 11th goal of the season. Back line lost the ball. You know, we're not... We're not holding the ball. Mil Milinovic Shora? I bet that doesn't fit on the back of the jersey. Okay, Wood takes his time to get there. Oh, nice ball over to Evans. And Evans plays it to Folks on the other team. They must be friends. They must have pints at the pub, um, you know, when time permits. Oh, there's a nice header down. Good ball. There's Tipton. Beats his man. And he goes near post. Can't find it. That would have been nice. We're, we're, we're showing some possibility. Now, the other problem is we're spending about $100,000 over our uh, wage budget. Oh, there's a cross. Nobody was in the box. That was too bad. All right, Evans gets there again. There's Wilson. A little bit of ball workage out on the flank. Lays it back to Bennett. He plays it all the way back. Right to the center. Oh, good save. Watson, nice. Offsides, maybe. All right, we get a free kick out of that. Show some passion. Oh, they're fired up. Except for this guy. He's frustrated. We are playing a 6-2 for Wilson. We'll keep an eye on that. Oh, Watson comes out and does his best Superman impersonation. All right, he lumps it out to Folks again. Folks is just, uh, I swear to God, his blue uniform must look white because they're passing it to him. Watson gets both hands on it, knocks it away. Oh, this is a home crowd, so we've got a few people up in the stands. Thank you for coming out. Always appreciated. All right, Bennett is dragging. We have been outshot, only one on target. You know, I think what this season, we're over halfway, right? It's going to be... Let's go for the revenge. Play it calm. Man, I just... Oof. We've just got to muddle. You know, when you take over mid-season like this, it's a matter of muddling through and just getting there, you know? Uh, that should be a card. Yellow. Probably nothing major. Oh, he gave him a red card for that. Really? Ooh. All right. All right. Let me make a sub here. Uh, Bennett for Jamo. Let's bring Jamo on. There we go. 
show some passion all right fired up all right newberry i don't think we've got oh wait i yeah carl roberts but didn't we say he sucked he's got a one finishing he's got a lot of pace oh god all right let me look at him see it doesn't tell me what his best position is that is just horrifying. It'll be good to get an ass man in here. That will be nice. Just to have some information. Oh, oops. Sorry about that, fellas. All right. Uh, let's encourage them. All right. Lumped up. Splits five, five defenders to hit his man right in the center circle i'd say that's some pretty deft passing oh he pushed him i don't know about that i would say that was a pretty chintzy foul if i had to oh keeper almost got to it 12th goal of the season for osumba 13 games without a defeat for them. Wow, that's pretty impressive. And Tipton. If we move Evans over, Massimiliano Massa. That's a name. Massa. Massimiliano. That's a good one. So I can't even go out and sign players because we're so far over. I'm going to really have to just finagle this group and hope. Oh, my God. No defense there. Good job just getting it cleared out. Oh, Robert steals it. Uh, he's lumbering, and he's only got a one finishing, remember. So that's this guy, Jones. You need to push up a little bit more there, buddy. All right, that's lumped in. Oh, he went up, but the keeper got to it. Come on. Well, we knew we were going to lose this one. We were not expecting a lot. Oh, they cleared it out. Bummer. Wilson gets to it. Oh, hoofed out again. Coming right back. I mean, we had, oh, that was, sh that was shit. That was shit. All right. Some tag team defense. Good job. Oh, in the middle. Take the shot. Oh, what a shot by Massa. Second goal of the season. We'll take that. I can take that as a moral victory. At least something happened. Holy crap. Not horrible. Over 50% on target. Five chances created. And that's one, you know, four days training in the tactic. I'm going to call that good, fellas. I am going to call that good. Um, tell you what, let's see. Let's go to the dressing room. Uh, let's do... Let's do cautious. You gave it your best. I agree. They looked, they looked solid. Like they might have an idea of what they're, what they're doing. You know. All right. Well, they lost as well. They drew, so they gained a point on us. They drew. They drew. So we didn't lose any ground to anybody. You know, not too much, at least, right? Wilson. Did I offer him a new contract? I must have. He looks shit, but playing a 636, he's shit. He's got good physicals, but that just means that, you know, with his with him having three stars, that just means the rest of our stuff is crap. Oh, I know what it was. Yeah. He uh, he was gonna run his contract out. So we were able to extend him, you know, at least at least we've got something there. All right, we'll come back and we'll look at uh, 
I need to get some, God, look at the run of form there. Jesus. Well, we have a fourth round. Um, timeout. Didn't we just say we've played 19 matches? Yes. 19. We play, th oh, league splits in two after 22 games. That's actually good. That's actually good because typically, and I'm just guessing here, but because I haven't, I haven't managed in this league before, but we'll be in the group with seven through 12. And we're pretty close to all these guys. So we won't be playing the new saints in Barrytown. We'll be paying teams in our, in our wheelhouse. So I want to come back pretty quickly, but why are we playing the same team back to back? Londuno, Yondu, Yod, Yod, double L's is a Y, I think. Yondudno, wow, that's that's a tongue twister. Gap Connas Quay, cool little logo. Do like it, red, white, and blue. Hmm? Seventeen seventy six, buddy. No, I'm just kidding. Um, God, I just saw all the unsubscribes. Let's come back for that match, uh, Gap Connors Quay, and then the Welsh Cup fourth round, and we'll play those. And hopefully by that time, that's uh, three weeks away, we should have our staff in place. So, and, you know, give us a couple of matches to play against these guys. So, first episode of a new season with a new club. Please, please, please hit the like button. Um, you know, and again, I'm shooting for, I'm shooting to get it up to 10 views. And let's go for five likes out of the five to six views. If you guys could give me a 100% likeage on this one, I'd appreciate it. See you guys later. Bye.